Hey everyone, it's Lauren Bolander with a special edition of Up to Speed from the Raleigh Golf Tournament at the Brickyard Crossing and this time I'm on Team Ray Hall. So actually, I wasn't doing so great when I started, but I'm starting to get a hold of my drives a little bit, which is exciting. Here's the thing though, I'm probably the best I'm probably the best pitcher on the team, honestly. Well, I think Lauren's doing the best. Yeah, I think she's chipping, putting. You know. Ryan's doing a great job. I'm doing a great job. Eric's doing a great job. Graham's doing an okay job. Well, so far, I think we've been playing pretty, pretty well. I think Dad's been struggling a little bit, but uh, I'm still won't say that too loud because he gets worked up. But I've uh, been trying to help Lauren out a little. She's playing pretty well. And uh, Hunter Ray never be serious. I wasn't even supposed to be out here today, but we won a trophy last time, and now I have a trophy about this big, and it's a, it's a guy golfing. It's pretty cool. I never thought I'd have a golf trophy in my life, so that's why I'm back out here with the Ray Halls. They, they know what they're doing, uh, golfing especially, so hopefully another trophy's coming. Okay, we're having some fun out here, so for now, I need to get back to my game, but I'll catch up with you guys again tonight from the red carpet of Jeans and Jewels. Okay guys, now we're at Jeans and Jewels, an annual event that benefits the Indy Family Foundation. So we're gonna go in and see what denim and bling we can find inside. Are you guys, are you enjoying Jeans and Jewels? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. I don't really have much to say, but yeah. <laughs> no, it's a great event, I went last year and uh, it's nice, you know, everyone's here and I'm trying to get out here early though to go to bed, gotta drive tomorrow. Is it um, hitting the clubs with your dad? You know, he closes them out. You know, he closes them down. Right, we, don't, we don't want to go there. You think you're going to wear some bling? Uh, there's, a, there's a chance. I mean, me coming from Barcelona, we're not so much into the bling stuff. But I've been here for 10 years, so I guess there's a little bit uh, blinking in me. <laughs> All right, go have fun. All right. <laughs> Recording artist John McLaughlin, you're in town for some of the IndyCar festivities here for the month of May, including Great. jeans and jewels. Are you excited? Very excited. Yeah? Very excited. I already got my, my pair of jeans. I'm sporting them tonight. Colin Dine, the CEO of William Rash Jeans, is a big sponsor tonight. How exciting this, is this to be at Jeans and Jewels? Oh, it's great. It's, uh, you know, I love being in Indy and uh, being out with Townsend and, you know, the William Rask car this weekend, it's, um, it's fantastic. Yeah, Townsend Bell, the driver you're sponsoring. This is pretty exciting to have the, the big man here partying with you tonight, right? It's great. You know, he's a uh, big reason why we're here and, and uh, certainly responsible for making all of us look good. So uh, really pleased that he came in town for the race. Yeah, and you certainly do look at Townsend. Ooh, look at this. We're living on a prayer, take my hand. No, not American Idol. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Woo. Are you kidding? Five o'clock in the morning, I got here from LA after dancing with the stars. It's over. I'm not the reigning champion on dancing anymore. So that means I need to get another trophy. Heather Carpenter, looks like Jeans and Jewels 2008 was another huge success for the Benevolent Fund of Motorsports. How's it going? We've raised almost over $100,000 for the Indy Family Foundation, the Benevolent Fund of Motorsports, so we can help so many people with this. It's just an awesome thing. All right, like Heather said, Jeans and Jewels 2008 was another huge success for the Benevolent Fund of Motorsports. Thanks for joining us here at IndyCar.com. I'm Lauren Bolander, and you're up to speed.